Hi, Maria. Hi. How are you doing today? Mm, not very well. Okay, I'm sorry about that. So it looks like today you are here for in, for a uh, gynecological exam. Yes. So can you confirm your date of birth, please? April 1st, 2001. Do you remember when was your last gyne exam? I think it was about two years ago. Two years ago. And did you have the pap smear back then? Yes. And everything was normal? Yes. Good. Do you have any pain or discomfort right now? Yes, I have some cramps and pain sometimes. Do you have this for how many days right now? Um, I don't know, uh, like five days. Five days? When was your last menstrual period? About uh, a week ago. A week ago? Okay. And your menstrual period is normal? It's kind of irregular? It's uh, irregular. For um, how many months it's like this? Well, like three months. Three months? Yes. Are you taking any medications for the pain? No. No? Are you taking any birth control pills? Yes. For how long? I think uh, three years. Three years? And do you feel okay? Yes. Good. Do you have any history of high blood pressure, diabetes, no. high cholesterol? No. No? Any surgeries? No. No? Were you pregnant? No. no. Okay, good. So I think I have everything in order. Any other uh, concerns that you want to address besides the uh, cramps and the pain? Mm -hmm. No. So I will do then, we'll do a pelvic exam. And also I will take in the end the sample for a pap smear because it's it's been two years. And we kind of want to do it every two years. And since you are new to the clinic, I will do that and I will test for any STDs, okay? But I will check also your belly and I will palpate your ovaries as well. Okay. Okay, good, Maria. So we'll start with the viral signs first, okay? Okay. Okay, so I'm going to take your temperature now to make sure you don't have any fever. So it's 36.8. And this is going on your index finger. Let's see. Just relax. It's 96 percentile of room air and heart rate is 91. That's good. Is this arm okay if I take the blood yes. pressure? Okay, squeeze your hand. Very good. Just relax. So your blood pressure is normal, 110 over 85. So I'm going to ask you now to change and uh, to take the count, okay? Okay. So I want to listen to your heart and lungs now. It is okay if I put the stethoscope behind the gown? Just gonna close your eyes and breathe normally for me ok 
Okay, you can please take a deep breath in and exhale now. One more time. One more time, please. Okay, very good. So I heard just S1 and S2, now S3 or S4. So everything is good in normal limits. I'm going to put my gloves on, Maria, and um, I would like, with your permission, to check your armpits first for any lymph nodes. Okay. Okay. So I will examine here first if you have any pain or discomfort let me know okay. I'm not feeling anything are you checking yourself sometimes yes yes you should do that every time or the shower if it's easier okay so nothing here to be worried of I'm gonna check the other side now okay. no enlargements everything is soft Good. Good. And now, with your permission, I would like to check your breast for any asymmetry or discoloration or any uh, nodules or lumps. Okay. Okay, Maria, so I'm checking your breast now. Okay. Let me know if you feel any pain or discomfort. I'm just gonna palpate slowly. Your color is good. It's, you have a normal color. I don't see any redness. Or asymmetry. Everything looks normal. I'm just going to palpate to make sure everything is fine. I don't feel any lumps around. But no discharge. Any pain of your breasts? No. Okay, good. So I'm going to check the other one now. So I'm going to check here right now. Slowly palpate to make sure I'm not missing anything. pain here okay not feeling anything abnormal the color is very good Good Maria, so everything was okay. I everything is in normal limits. I forgot to ask you, do you have any problems with your thyroid? Uh, I don't, but my mom, my mom had and uh, had a surgery for that. Okay, so she had the thyroid removed. Yes. And you don't have any symptoms, no problems so far. No, no not yet. Okay. Then it's okay if I check your thyroid yes. on the outside and I will palpate. Yes. Do you feel any tenderness? 
And did you have any labs done regarding the tire wheel? No. To see the levels? No. no. Okay, I want you to swallow for me and to check the tire wheel. It's okay if you drink just a little bit of water. Yes. Just swallow. Okay, so no pain around, no tenderness, no discomfort. Okay, hey Maria, so I'm going to listen to your belly first. You can relax. You have normal sounds of the belly. So I'm going to gently palpate. What side did you say it hurts? The left yeah. or the left? Yes. Okay, so I'll be gentle. Let me know if you have any pain. When I'm pressing down? Yes. Just checking for any tenderness right now. The color is normal. I don't see any redness. Checking the other side. Any pain here? Any pain here? Mm -hmm. Are you comfortable while I'm doing this? Yes. Checking your belly button as well. Everything is normal. Okay, I do see some discoloration of the skin right here in a big mole. Yes. On the left side. Yes. Do you know you have them for a while? Yes, I birth. Oh, from birth? I'm going to tap now. Mm -hmm. 
any discomfort? Yes, a little bit. I'm going to check your skin now. To make sure you don't have any other problems. So this is the mole and here is the discoloration of the skin. It's round and kind of dark your skin looks otherwise very good in hydrated test just want to check something the skin is very elastic and that's good and hydrated like I said Good, Maria. So now we're gonna perform the pelvic exam. Okay. Good, Maria. So what I'm gonna do first, it's a, a, vi a visual inspection. I'm gonna use the pen light. So I'm just gonna observe on the outside, okay? So normal color, I don't see any redness no inflammation do you have any pain or discomfort here no <clears throat> so everything looks good to me i don't see any abnormalities so i'm gonna use the plastic speculum and i'm gonna take like i said Two samples so one for the pap smear because it's been two years and another one for any STDs to make sure everything is fine okay, okay. so I'm gonna prepare my speculum Maria can you come a little bit closer yes oh, okay so I'm gonna insert the speculum Just relax so this is like a brush and I'm gonna put it right here this is the first sample and I'm going to take the other one Okay, good. Now you may be experiencing some spotting for the next 24 hours and that's normal. Okay. But otherwise, everything looks good. I didn't see anything abnormal. The cervix looks very healthy. So when you want, you can stand up and uh, we can discuss the results, okay? okay. Maria, so I'm done with the exam for today. So 
Let me see something. So everything is within normal limits, like I said. And uh, I will have the results for the pap smear and the other one in 10 days. So I will call you with the results if it's any problem. If everything is normal, then I will see you back in six months or one year, okay? Sure. So I just want to order um, an ultrasound for your belly because you said you have some pain on the left side on your ovaries. Ovary, I didn't feel anything, <clears throat> no tenderness, but I just want to make sure because you said you have cramps, pain for the past three months, and maybe you have something there that we want to make sure we find it from the beginning, okay? okay? So then I will order the ultrasound for you and um, some labs, and I also will check your thyroid levels, okay? Okay. to see if that's uh, also within normal limits okay. so otherwise everything was good and i will see you back in one year okay, okay. or six months if it's uh, any problem or if you have any concern call me or if you have any pain okay, okay. do you have any questions for me right now no no everything is good and clear yes okay thank you so much for coming Thank and you. I will see you next time. Thank you.